Another day, another Timu haul. But I'm losing light, so we're gonna be fast. However, I don't know how fast we can be. Um, this is one, this is two, and there's $300 worth of stuff in here. Just to let you know, I do not pay $300. I only paid 60 because we got a really cool promotion where we chose, I think, like 15 things and we only paid for six of them. So, but let's get to it because this is going to take longer and the sun is setting. And if you didn't know, I won a $200 coffee machine. It's coming in the next Timu video. So stick around because I have no life. <laughs> so remember, I did get like half of these things for free. So some of them were just fillers. But we're going to go right off the top, and the first thing that we have is a digital counting money jar. And I'm probably going to do shorts on all these items to let you guys know. I don't think I paid for these, but I will put the price of the actual item on there. It's really just like count the amount of money you have as you put it in. And I got this because we have a lot of coins around the house, and we really don't realize the weight of it. And we did get the one with the silver band. It's pretty simple. Just come with a screwdriver. Don't know why. I'm assuming it's just to clamp it. Pretty simple. Next item. <laughs> anyway, I got a lapel mic. Now, I'm not going to use this today, but I will probably use this in the next video where we have the $200 coffee machine because I am trying to get better audio for you guys. And I hope that this helps in some way, shape, or form. Don't know if it will. Eh, it was free. Don't care. Next. I got that one. So this is a travel jewelry container. This one was also a few dollars and I got this because I, when I travel, there's only so much jewelry that I take and this is gonna save me so much time. If you guys don't know, I have like 20 piercings, two in my nose, like six in each ear. So I do carry quite a bit of jewelry and I am known for leaving jewelry behind when we travel. It is a pretty sturdy case, so this was cheap. I'm just saying, I'm not angry at all. Actually, wait, I actually don't like this. It does smell a bit, but that's on me. Yeah, it has a little thing for all your jewelry. Oh shit, and it pops out. Nice to know. So I did get this little LED fiber optic light. We had these when we were kids. It's very big where we come from. So I thought I would get it. I didn't, I forgot that the stand was silver though. I was hoping for a black one, but you know, Hopefully it works. Hopefully it's pretty. I just wanted the little whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. If you guys are on TikTok, you've probably seen diamond dots. I have a lot of the stuff for it because at some point I thought that it was going to be like the new hobby. I have a lot of new hobbies if you guys can just look around my room. Um, but it comes with a storage container for all your different dots. I think these are like labels right here. I don't know what this is, but I'll figure it out. Um, and then a tray, some gloves, and a bunch of the little different sticks. And they do have like the long one, the daughters. That's about it. And just a lot of the little gummy, grippy tape. Now this thing did say fragile, so we probably have a few things that are going to be fragile. I don't know about this. It came in a separate package. I know what this is. So I think this is one of the things we paid for. It was like six-ish dollars, but it's a fold out jewelry storage thing and I will show you guys what it looks like with actual jewelry on it oh. guys this is so fragile I can already tell this is probably like the most cheapest plastic there is I mean will it work yeah and if it wasn't free would I have gotten it maybe I don't know I'm not a fan of the quality here but it does have a lot of storage so if you're someone who has a lot of earrings or even if you had a small business for earrings honestly not a bad idea keep I said keep and I want to go grab the next item this front one right here you guys can see all the top ones have a little thing this one's broken like I said very cheap if it was not free I'd probably be angry at the quality of this they'll get a very nice review another thing that has been all over TikTok is these lamps and they are literally just the ones where like the sand falls and it creates a picture. I don't remember which one I got. I'm pretty sure, oh, I got the black one, which makes sense, because it was either black or blue. Anyway, um, I got the black one, and I really wanted this for my desk, and I think it's glass, and that's why they have the fragile symbol on it. I completely understand, and honestly, I appreciate it immensely. Much smaller than I thought it would be. I wanna say that right now, this is 
very petite. Um, damn, they look so much bigger in the photos. And I know they have dimension dimensions on there. Now mine does light up and I know some of them don't, but I made sure that I got a light up one and it was, there was a few options for the free items, but it uh, basically you just kind of, I have a feeling mine's broken. Wait, guys. Um, I have a slight feeling that mine just might be broken because I see a lot more bubbles than all the people on TikTok. Sorry, you guys have reflections on the ring light. Um, unless it's a post, yeah. If it does start out like this, then okay. Someone help. Someone who has one of these, bought one of these, someone from TikTok, tell me, is this how it's supposed to be? Like, I think once the bubble pops, it's all supposed to slow down. Yeah, but how does the bubble pop? The air has to go somewhere. Yeah, the air goes up or something. Troubleshooting. We'll figure it out. But it is free and I am, I mean, I'm not mad. You know, I wanted one. So, part of the hype. I am happy with the, I'm so sorry, the reflection. I am really happy with the colors though. And there's, if you saw, there's like little flecks of gold. So, I am going to be excited to see how this looks with the light on. If you guys did not know, I am doing a full 2023 transformation. And part of that is taking care of myself and self-care. I know how to do my own acrylics and nails, but I did want to get a full set of nail cutters for my acrylics, cuticle cutters, and then this is just the cuticle pusher and the trimmer. Ow! Okay, um, sharp, it's gonna work. Of course, we will have the price to everything here. Um, I just really like the kind of color of these. And for those of you who are starting out in like nail tech and you want to have like your own things, there are a lot of different colors and options. For these tools, um, I don't expect, yeah, I don't expect great quality. They do feel really cheap, but like, what, what can I say? It's Timu. Um, if this was my free item, whatever. But at the same time, I got my stuff from the dollar store, so. For our next item. Such a delayed throw. Anyway, our next item is another tool. How many tools did I buy? I don't know. It was for, like we just got a bunch of free stuff. So they literally just said, hey, choose a bunch of stuff, a random amount you're not going to pay for. Um, it is well bubble wrapped. Okay. It's a rotary tool. It's for my sister. She wanted a, a she has spoken. It's a drill, not a rotary tool. She wanted a drill. How much was this? Do you remember? Was it? it was like six or 16. I think it was one of our free items though. It comes with a little tool to make sure that it's fixed. And this is, that's literally just all that came with it. Um, no, it doesn't. Oh no, it comes with heads. Sorry. It comes with the drill bits. If I saw those, I would have known. But um, she got this cause she wanted, she's been wanting one for a while and we free item. So let's see how it works. No clue what this next one is. I always love Timu because it's not like AliExpress where like it's been months, right? It's fast shipping. But at the same time, I don't know what I got. I really don't know what we got. Okay, wait. Oh, okay. So if you guys have also seen on TikTok, don't ever freaking touch this end, by the way. We had one of these a long time ago. I think I got them from Daiso. Um, and because it was not part of the free items, we got a bag sealer. Basically, you charge it. Ours last one had batteries, but you charge it and like, say you opened your bag of chips, right? I, I don't have a bag of chips, but you opened your bag of chips and you want to, you don't have a bag clip. You just take this and you seal it and it just melts it back together. Yeah. You could probably use a hair dryer, like a small hair straightener or whatever the fuck, but we got that because unfortunately we buy a lot of things in bulk and no one ever finishes them before. Now, if you guys did not watch my very first Timu haul, you know that I bought two computer mats. I actually have them on my brand new desk setup right now. So when my sister realized that they were not terrible quality, we decided to get another mat. It's not for me, but it is going to go on her setup. And it is strawberries? Are they strawberries? Mm -hmm. They're strawberries. She got strawberries. And of course, these are the extra large mats. So they are fairly big. This is about the same size as the same size as mine. Um, they're a little bit thinner than mine, I'm noticing. But again, this I think is like $10 if you actually bought it. So for the price, Timu, pretty good. And I'm pretty sure this was one of the free items. I think so. Yeah. So, win. 
Wait, guys. Look, look, look. The little bunny. Is they're harvesting? They're harvesting the strawberries. Okay. Next. This is kind of heavy. It's kind of like busted. Like this came kind of like this. So. Oh no. I remember why this is fragile. It's Give me a second. Broken. Okay, so thankfully it's not broken. But if you guys also saw my first video, I got something very similar to this as a free gift from playing the three hat trick game. This one comes with a little stand and it is the Milky Way. Now I did give, oh, I'll just block the light for you guys, but um, it's like the literal Milky Way. Okay, I'll take another video so you guys can see better. But um, look at that. So I got this because I gave the other two lights to my sister and brother because they liked it better than me. And this was part of the free items. And I'm a big Star and Moon fan if you guys have not seen anything I talk about. So, yep, I got, I'm going to be very careful. Got this. We got a lot of lamps. Now, as you've noticed, not everything that I buy is for me. I am very much a family person. And so this next item that I got, to all my people who love anime, um, Timu is very big on their anime merch. And I decided to get something for my brother because he is getting to the age where he's really loving anime merch. Let me take this off, I'll be right back. So it's gonna be very hard for you guys to tell, but that is a Naruto. And um, Aiden, my little brother, recently has been into them massively. You do just plug it in and turn the lights on. So I will show you guys that. But I got this as one of the free items um, because, you know, I'm trying to like zhuzh up his room. You will see some other things for him. So there's that. But I do absolutely love this. And I honestly, the quality, I'm kind of surprised. Like Timo's, Timo's, what the fuck? I mean... I can curse. I don't care. And like I said, we're a family channel, so <laughs> my mom wanted a dumpling mold. I think she saw this exact one on Amazon. Yeah. So yeah, she saw the exact one on Amazon. So when we got this, or when we got the um, offer, we saw this. And basically what happens is you have your little, your wrapper. You put your filling in, and then you push it down, and at the bottom comes out your dumpling. I think it's cute. Um, if I can, I'll show you guys a video of this being done, but I'm gonna break it. Let me stop. She'll be happy. Mom happy? I'm happy. Don't care. And the last thing in our first bag is a bank. This is also all over TikTok. Like, if you guys saw these when that one girl, like, showed that, like, she put a little credit card in and you saved your money in it, and it was basically like having your own ATM. And I got this originally for me. Um, and I was going to give the little coin bank to my brother. But I think I'm going to give him this. And look at that. Oh my god. Okay. I'm assuming there's like instructions on how to do everything. But like, they have a little bill slot and you use the little number code to make sure. And of course there's batteries and there's no actual batteries in here. But this, honestly, I know I didn't pay for this. But I think it was like $15 to $20 and the one on Amazon's are like $60. Your girl, this is, I'm happy with this. It's pretty, like, sturdy, too. Of course, I'd probably break it, but it's for Aiden, so. We're trying to make him look A+. Plus. Teaching him finance early, because you know that's important. But we're not done. We have another bag. So, next bag. Let's go. So, it turns out, I should have counted the items in the first bag. That was the entirety of my orders, where we ordered, what, 15 items, and we paid for six of them. That cost me 60 bucks. The total was 230 I think, retail. You can do the math if you really don't trust my numbers, but I don't care. The second one is a free item that I got with my coffee machine that you guys will see next week. That's going to be an entire video because it's a $200 coffee machine. And I want to make sure it actually works because apparently you can make latte art with it. But this was my second gift from that. And it's an electronic coffee grinder. I had a reason for getting it. You get it? Because, like, coffee machine grinder. Um, my mom actually wanted this, uh, again, because she wants to grind her spices. But I can't really show you guys the quality of this. I will probably show you guys this again next week. But to let you know, this was $50 if I was to buy it. I got it absolutely free. And it's actually, whoa, actually pretty sturdy. It just comes with, so you got the bottom, a singular cup, 
The cup does have a lid. It's just a little acrylic lid. And then the top and the plug. Now I am very um, skeptical of electronics, which is why when this coffee machine comes, I'm gonna have an entire video because I don't know, something about buying things that I have to plug into the wall versus like things I can charge or things I have my batteries in. Just kind of iffy about it. There's an entire manual though, so gonna definitely read through this before we use it. So yeah. $300, $200 with the Timu stuff, some of which I didn't really pay for. We can easily say I have an addiction. Yeah, the jewelry machine kind of sucks. Yeah, the mouse pad kind of smells. And I think, just gonna say, I think this is broken. But for the cost, for the cost, the amount of stuff I got, Timu's here to stay. And as you know, I have maybe six or seven more orders coming. Safe to say I have an addiction. But, doesn't mean that it's perfect. So, be careful with what you buy. If you need anything, I'm here. And as always, if you like the video, like the video. And stick around because I'm not going anywhere either. And remember, I'm not a professional. I'm just a middle child. I love you. Bye!